And also, let me just put it out there real quick. I don't believe in ADHD. My teacher, she tried to put ADHD on me in the seventh grade. She went to my father. She said, your son may have ADHD. My father said, the fuck is that? She said, attention deficit hyperactive disorder. When my father heard this order, you know, we black. Disorder means you're retarded. You're sick. There's something fucked in your head. She was like, I had a student, blah, blah, blah. She took it. She went from a D to an A. I left that classroom. I was like, what are you going to give me that drug? I'm trying to be an A student. He was like, none of my sons are retarded. Just focus. And guess what? That was true. I wasn't retarded. I just needed to focus. So I am completely against trying to medicate your children when it comes to things like, for example, what if you, what depression. if you wouldn't, what if you wouldn't have focused? No, but here's the thing. Yeah. You need to be given enough time to figure out your own challenges. It's like somebody who has never went to the fucking gym a single day in their life, but they've started taking steroids. Like, brother, fucking go to the gym for at least a fucking year. You're okay. a teenager. You're not even fully developed. I understand These what you're people... saying, but like, you, you, you unintentionally you use like the perfect example, right? Sometimes drugs can be really fucking helpful. A guy that doesn't go to the gym and takes steroids is actually going to be more ripped than a guy that goes to the gym and doesn't, right? There might be a person with ADHD who takes medication and can focus better than like than than, than other students that, um, especially students with ADHD, that wouldn't take the drug otherwise, right? So I mean, like, if it can help a ton, why not, right? Especially if the or, side effects are so or... minimal. Or you could just give them some sort of placebo pill and tell them this ADHD medication and it's gonna help. You could, you could try that, but unfortunately, I'm pretty sure uh, amphetamines beat placebos. Amphetamines are real. They have an impact on your mind. The for everybody saying, hold on, real quick, for everybody saying wrong as fuck, what I just said was 100% true. Uh, sorry if that bothers you. Go wrong. do the research. I don't, I don't no, feel no, like... No, no, don't do the research. Y'all are correct, okay? Stay no, on No, 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 I'm talking about when I'm talking about roiding. People that do roids will um people that do roids like on big cycles will build more muscle not going to the gym than a natty guy that goes and he trains and goes to the gym no, that is 100 no, no, i actually Sorry, i actually okay. it, it is kind of true but not really that true because if you go today i think actually i think you're fucking it up i think you're comparing wait, 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 hold on my fucking stream just died okay i think you're getting it wrong by the way i'm pretty sure you're getting it wrong okay, i think okay, it was it, it was comparing uh as steroid users to non-gym goers actually fuck it who gives a fuck okay go for anyways it. where were we Wherever you wanted to be. No, 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 don't tell me where we were, because guess what? One of the positives of not taking no fucking Ritalin or whatever the fuck the medication for ADHD is, is the fact that I'm able to fucking, you know, tie shit together. Because when I was a kid, I used to go on a, a billion tangents, right? Mm -hmm. And I was never able to go back to the root of the conversation. But, hey, given enough practice and given enough time, everybody's going to figure it out, right? Do you think? And we're talking... Apps are fucking lowly. I've seen so many. The thing, the problem with ADHD Wait, medication. Wait, do you think? I'm is, just curious. Do you think I'm like a decently smart guy? You don't have to suck my dick too hard. That's what you're trying to get me to do. Oh yeah. Do you, what do you think my grade average was in school? I'm just curious. I don't tie. Uh, I don't tie smartness with academic smartness. So oh. you could have been fucking retarded. Okay, I do. I I was like a C minus D plus student. Now that got bumped to like a B minus, I think, because all of my classes um, were so heavily weighted because of um, AP courses and shit. But I don't know, man. I think that I feel like after doing a bunch of research for Nathan and looking at his shit, I kind of wonder if ADHD medication would have helped the fuck out of me for school. No, <laughs> I think it might have. I think it would have. I don't know, dude. No, I, I had a really so. hard time when it came to studying and doing homework and shit. If it was like a class that I could pick up because I was pretty good at like picking information up quickly, then I could like breeze through it. But if I had to study, I was fucked. Absolutely fucked in the ass. So like, I don't know. So, so, but you do acknowledge, right? And I know ADHD works in this way. Mm -hmm. If you're interested in something, you could hone it on in it and like do it for 12 hours straight. Like if you really, if you're really into a book, like I remember I used to be into the Hunger, uh, Hunger Games books, right? I could sit there for two hours, just read the book. Like, I sure, I agree. Yeah, right. I don't know if it's, I don't, I'm not sure where we're at right now on this, but I think most people agree that like people with ADHD can exhibit like hyper focus, where if it's something you're interested in, you can sit there and do Yeah, I play StarCraft 2 for 16 hours yeah, a day. Which yeah, which seems like it's fucking convenient, by the way. Oh, yeah, these, these people, they're terrible at focusing. Only if they're really interested in something. Dipshit, you sound like the average person at that no, no, point. No, 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 no. Hold shit. on, hold on, hold on. The problem with people with ADHD isn't that they're terrible at focusing. The problem is that they're terrible at directing their focus, right? So, I'm I'm speaking out for a neurotypical mind. I don't know if this is true or not, but it's just what people say, right? If a person has to like do a task that they don't want to do, they can do it. It sucks, but they can do it. But for people with ADHD, trying to direct your attention like that to a task that you have no interest in is like excruciating. Like the amount that you have to overcome to direct yourself to do a task that you have no interest in is so much greater than a person with a more normal mind. That's like the difference. So the only difference is it takes them more effort to focus on some shit that they don't want to do. Yeah. That's it. 
That's a, does manager. that seem because I've had some like shout out to like my brothers, you know what I mean? My friends, I had like my friends say the stupidest, most retarded shit. Like, I have ADHD, that's why I'm getting an F. No, you're getting an F because you're retarded and you're not studying. You get what I'm trying to say? People, you know why I hate mentally ill people? Tell me why. Can I tell you why? Tell me why. I, I, I'll, I'll tell you why. Okay. 